but what do you think it's going to look like for nonprofits? Because, you know, we're having some issues where the IRS has been taking away some of the um, donations. So I think that you're providing a solution where we are helping nonprofits, for-profits are really um, working together to support them and it increases their donor base. Right. And so there's a couple of things. So especially being where we were at here, just outside of Tampa and like St. Pete, like based in that area, everybody's going after pretty much the same dollars in the community. Like there's only so many corporations that have so much dollars to give. Right. Mm -hmm. So that's number one. And I, I know that's that I know that's very like a very basic pragmatic statement, like common sense statement. But when you break it down and break down the layers, you're like, OK, look, how can we give back to those dollars, though, as mm -hmm. a nonprofit? It's coming from strictly from like a startup nonprofit, even a medium nonprofit that seems some growth. It's like, yo, what can you do to create something that really gives back to that corporation that donated to you? How can you create that long-term relationship so you have that? Right. So you, your cultures are together. You're one, right? And mine always, again, that's why the the pairing corporations with nonprofits through retreats. Like we always had something that we were serving back to them, meaning, yo, you get this training, you paid for it. It's a donation, but you paid for it. Come check out this growth mindset training with these kids for four hours. We're going to run you through four workshops. It's going to be great. Let's go. 